Hey people, we are on 31 now. Oh my gosh, we only have a little bit more to go. I don't want the story to end. I can't believe what's happening to me. I thought that finally it would it was time for me to be happy. Finally I was about to have the life I deserved. Life I always wanted. But everything is ruined now. It's a bitch out of jail. Or is she? No, she should still be in jail, though, for child abuse. So, I don't understand. Please, I'm begging you, don't do this. I know you didn't kill John. I can't let you go to jail, okay? I can't. You're accused of murdering John Petterman. How do you plead? I plead guilty, Your Honor. Thirty years. Damn. They sentenced him to thirty years in prison. <sighs> thirty years of prison? I can't believe he lied to say that this bitch. I know, right? Shit. Well, it ain't no fucking K bitch. I didn't know he was so stupid. My mother is cold is a cold hearted woman. She would never have done the same for him at all, girl. But at least I'm not cha charged for John's murder anymore. The trial will begin next month. There's no way they trust her. Uh, you were abused. She hit you and put you in danger. And your lawyer has evidence against her. You're going to win this trial. I'm sure of it. Anyways, let's talk about something else, please. What do you want to, um, oh, uh, wait, what about you? Have you met Tom's father? He still doesn't want to see me. He doesn't care about Tom. I know, but he helped me, so maybe he's not that bad. Anyways, what about you and Liam? We're fine. He's really nice to me. About that, there's something you need to know. What is it? Somebody about to walk up. Liam slapped Joanne at the trailer park. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, Liam would never do that. That's what he did. He had a fight with Joanne and he slapped her. No. Why? <laughs> I don't know exactly, but it was about you for sure. Is Joanne mad at me? Of course not, but she's really mad at Liam and now she doesn't want to talk to him again. Great, now both of them are mad at each other. <laughs> and he slapped the shit out of her ass. <laughs> oh, shit. I love him so much. He's the love of my life. Oh, really, is he, girl? He's the only one who makes me happy. When I met him, I fell in love with him instantly. He fixed me. He took every piece of my broken heart and put them together. Girl, you a liar, bitch. I was such a mess. I was so in love with Gabe. I wanted to date him for so long. But he never cared about me, clearly. And one day. He met her. Are you lost? Actually, I'm new here, so... Yeah, I'm a bit lost. I can show you the place. Thank you, that's really nice of you. No problem. I'm gay, by the way. I'm Alice. And so when he started to date her... Everyone loved her. Everyone found her beautiful. She wasn't more beautiful than me. She was smart. She was always nice and smiling. Blah, blah, blah. She was the kind of girl I hated. Girl, is that because you were stupid? So 
but my friends and I started to spread rumors about her to make them break up. But it didn't work. So I decided to wait. And one night I had the chance I, uh, to have what I wanted. Mm -hmm. She just broke up with him. He was sad and drunk. So it was pretty easy to convince him. Do you want to go upstairs? I don't think it's a good idea. I thought you were single. What do you think she's doing right now? I'm sure she's not crying all alone in her bedroom. She must be somewhere partying with some dudes. Otherwise, why else would she break up with you? I'm hot. You're hot. You could have everything you want with me. Um, I will love. I would never leave you like she did. Um, you need to get over her. You're right. I need to get over her. <laughs> That's all she was right about, girl. I thought that he would love me once he realized that I was better than Alice. Are you sure you want to do that? Of course I am. Do you have protection? Don't worry about that. We don't need it. Oh my God, how was I wrong? How how I was wrong? You're not like nine months later. I gave birth to Blake alone while Gabe and Ellis live in the perfect life with their brand new little baby. Our life is like life is so unfair. You know you're not forced to keep this baby. Mm, there's also adoption. You're young. You have no support from your family. You can have, uh, she can have a better life and you could start a new life too. Why would she deserve a better life? Mm, she ruined everything. Bitch, what? My parents disowned me. They disinherited me. I lost everything. I want to keep her. Are you sure about that? Yes, I am. Have you thought about a name? I walked to the crib and I looked at her. They say once you hold your your baby in your arms, you love him instantly. Well, that's not true. Her birth was a curse. No, bitch. Her birth was you just being a thought, bitch. I want to call her Blake. Right after that, I left with Blake. All right, I le right after that, I left Blake with my aunt. She was the only one who still wanted to talk to me. Of course, Blake doesn't remember that. She was too young to probably be, and probably too stupid to understand anything. So I found a job in an apartment. I was partying every night. But my heart was still broken and empty. At that moment, I thought that Blake could change that. You can't do this, Kate. She's living with me since she was born. You never visit her. It's my daughter. You knew this day would come. She has everything she needs here. You're living like a, you're living in a ready apartment. She needs her mother, and I'm here to take her back. Period. Kate, please don't do this. It's been five years. I don't care. Gata, why are you sad? Um, please, Kate, I'm begging you. Don't take her away from me, please. My my decision is final. Um, Blake, sweetie, do you remember when we talked about your mommy? This woman is... You're mommy, sweetie, and you're going to live with her now. No, I don't want to go. I want to stay with you. I know, sweetheart, but you see, you'll see. It's going to be fine, and you'll and I'll see you soon. 
You'll see. Come here now. You have to listen to your mom, Blake. Take care of her. I will. What do you think of her mother? But it hasn't turned out exactly the way I thought it would. I want to go see Gata. Mm. You should like me, not her. I don't like you. She was so annoying. She didn't even want to be with me. Well, bitch, she didn't know you, girl. But I thought that the best solution was to continue to party. Continue to meet guys. But Blake was always there to ruin everything. Could you stay in oh wait, couldn't you stay in the bedroom? I wanted to see you. He left because of you. You're so useless. That was the first day I slapped her. You slapped Joanne? <laughs> How do you know that? Jen told me, but that's not the problem here. What were you thinking about? You were, you were not there. She went too far. Too far? Because she talked to you? You don't know what she said. Doesn't justify you slapping her. Should I be afraid of you? No, of course not. How can I know that? You're my girlfriend. I love you. I would never lay a finger on you, and you know that. Joanne's your friend. Was Well, was your friend. Also your girlfriend. She wasn't my... Do you realize what you did to her? Is that the person you want to be? I'm so sick of this. I'm sick of seeing you fight constantly. I want to see my friend. I don't want to lose you. And the solution is making me sad. I'm sick of this. Okay. Blake, wait. I'm sorry. Of course, I'm not proud of what I did. <laughs> I was so mad. Mad at her, but also mad at me. She was right. It was my fault, So You need to stop. It was my choice, and no one could make, have made me change my mind. I threatened her to leave town if she told you the truth. And I did everything I could to hide the truth from you. I couldn't have changed. You couldn't have changed anything. I'm sorry I was such a jerk sometimes. Well, yeah. I can't forbid you to see her. Even if I'm not very happy about that, <laughs> I don't have the right to do that. Thank you so much. And this bitch just sitting here fucking thanking. <laughs> Is she about to kill herself or something? No one wanted a girl who had a child. I was stuck with her. Oh, you should have took her ass back to Agatha's ass until I met John. <laughs> Excuse me, miss. Look at John. Crazy-eyed ass. I immediately knew he was rich by the clothes he was wearing and the way he walked. So when I saw that he was flirting with me, I knew it was my best opportunity. He wasn't good looking at all, but beauty doesn't matter when you're rich. Mm. years passed and I can't stand him anymore his attitude his ugly face his voice the way he always took Blake's side luckily I was always outside I had my friends and their parties And one night I met him, Andrew. He was handsome, smart, nice, and charming. He also had some money. I, he was everything I was looking for. He ain't got that much money, bitch. For years we lived the good life behind John's back. We spent all the time we had together. He was the only one who could make me happy. That's why I was so mad when I got back. I would have had to go back to the, my house because I never could stand the idea of being with someone else than him, someone other than him, someone else other than him. 
And now I'm going to spend the rest of my life without him. I didn't even know how I could do that. He sacrificed himself to save me. I could have killed John so many times. I wanted to get rid of him so hard. But I didn't kill him. The day you killed John, you never told me what happened. I thought it wasn't necessary. <laughs> I want to know what happened that day. I went to your house, then I ordered him to follow me. He he had what he deserved. I made him suffer. He admitted the truth. And then I watched him die. Did he say something before he died? Girl, he said a lot of ignorant shit before he died. He said he was sorry. Really? No. No, you're lying. Yeah, he said he regretted everything. I'm so relieved. No, bitch, that's not what he said. Why would you lie to her like that? <sighs> everything is Blake's fault. She blamed me for John's murder, and now she's suing me for child abuse. She won't get away with this. I'll take the best lawyer and I'll destroy her. She has no idea what she did. She took away. Well, she took the love of my life away from me. Mm, she won't go away with it. She won't get away with it. Yeah. Bullshit episode, y'all. Bullshit episode. It wasn't nothing really positive in this shit. It was just, you know. Yeah. All right. <laughs>